Okay, we're back with um my Nintendo Switch collection part four. So what we have here is uh Kiba Strip, um Hellbound and Debriefs. Um so I thought this was Yeah. It's alright, you know. I feel like the one on the PS Vita, um, um, Akiba Strip, um, I guess, I think it's called, um, what, what is it? I might need to, well, I forget it. I'll probably show that to y'all some other time. Alright, um, we've got the Super Mario 3D All-Star Collection. I was very fond of this one. Um, only problem I have with this is that it didn't come with, we all know. Super Mario Galaxy 2. They probably just gonna let that be by itself. They're gonna re-release it and probably limited runs gonna say, we're gonna make it limited. You know, and then I'm gonna be like, oh now I gotta go through all this again. And if I don't buy it off the site in time or or pre-order it, now I gotta buy it from the third seller. Ha! $120, $240 just for one freaking game. Oh shoot, that's double the price. Uh, but very good game. Um if you like Super Mario 64. Um, Super Mario Sunshine, Super Mario Galaxy. This is a good collection to have. I actually owned Super Mario 64 on the DS, which I also enjoyed. And, well, it's hard, kind of hard to say which is better because you get to play as Joshi, Wario, and Luigi. And you can't play as it in the original 64 version. This is crazy. You know, that was good. Um, we got Tales of Historia, um, Infinite Edition, um, very good Tales game. Also, um, got into the Tales game on the 3DS and the PS3, which, um, yeah, that's when I started noticing this one, but then find out this was actually on the 360, but just didn't jump into it when it got released, but ended up buying it on the Switch. Good game. Um, this one's called... Uni Nako Naki Uni Uni Nuki, I believe. Can't really pronounce it. Oh, so maybe I can say it right here. Well, it's a good game. Um, I actually like the gameplay on it. I ain't saying it just reminds me of Diablo or of anything, but you know, it was pretty tight, you know. So we got Rumi Lore, um Lost of Girl in the Land of Lords. Um it's a very good game. I enjoyed it. Um, I don't know what it is about, like, games that have, like, that angle, like, the Diablo and all that, you know, it just seemed kind of tight. Um, we got Fear, um, Infinite Edition, uh, very good game, very unique game, it's pretty much that type of game, like, every time you find somebody, they're always a boss, and you're like, do you, you can't give me time to level up, but it's not like one of those games, like, you can just come up and it's like, you really got to use skill in this thing, man. I'm telling you, when I first played this, man, I put this thing on easy. And I had to cheat. <laughs> I had to go through the story block in this one. I went through the story block. I said, bump that story. Too much. I tried that for like two hours. I said, bro, I ain't getting the hang of this. I'm going to get right back into it, though. Um, We got Darksiders, Genesis. Um, another Diablo type of gameplay type game. Um, it's very fun, you know. Well, it doesn't play like one, two, and three of Dark Siders though. Um, Resident Evil Triple Pack. Very good game. Um, Resident Evil Four is the main game of this. If you ask me, you can download um, Resident Evil Five and Six. Very great game. Um, I've also enjoyed it. Um, but 4 and 5 was probably my favorite out of all of them. Just be honest. You know, I knew the ones I got into. When I played on the 360, you know, for 5, that just, that was the, that was the thing. So we got Ghostbusters, the video game remastered. Um, this is a very great game. Like, I'm not even going to lie to you. It's a very great game. Um, I enjoyed it. I ain't going to, like, it's just one of those games where you know you've seen the movie and you just got to be like, you know what, I like it, you know. I felt like it was great. It was very unique in its own way, you know. It's very unique. Very unique. Um, We got Risk of Rain 2. Um, I think that this is a cool game, too. It's just different from other games that I've also played. I mean, the world is... 
the world is different. <laughs> the art style of the world is different. So you, you would enjoy this one. Um, that, those, those are some good ones, man. But I played like so many, man. Like it's so hard to re like basically remember all these games, man. I'm like, oh man, this, I got like a lot of stuff to catch up on, man. Cause, woof, man. I ain't gonna lie, I've been hitting that Breath of the Wild, man, and, and and the other RPG games I've been touching up on, man, them things take up some time, bro, but you know what? You know, it was great, but I'm glad that y'all, you know, enjoying the video, um, just um, like and subscribe, um, help support the channel, and I'll see y'all in the next one.